two, three. So I have some fresh landlocked salmon that I caught today at Quabbin Reservoir and I'll be cooking up a couple fillets. I'm going to dip it in some olive oil. So first I'm going to put some lemon juice. A little pepper. Salt. And a bit of dill. And some Italian breadcrumbs. And that is it. It's pretty simple. And now for the lake trout, I'm going to put a little olive oil in here. Fresh lake trout that I caught this morning, this afternoon at Coabin Reservoir. Some nice fillets. Dip it in the olive oil. Roll it in the olive oil. Got another small fillet in there too. Same thing, a bit of lemon juice. Freshly ground pepper. Get a salt. A few pinches of dill. And lastly, Italian breadcrumbs. I think I'll put a bit of flaxseed on here. For you health nuts. And that is it. I've got the oven on 400. I'll put in with the salmon. And I'll see you in a bit. All right, we have our lake trout. Salmon. And we have our potatoes. Throw a 
bit of butter on the potatoes. Little salt, little pepper. Little bit of cheese, or a lot of cheese. <laughs> And I'm gonna throw a little sour cream on there. All right, well, it's time to eat. Try some of the lake trout. Delicious. Now for the salmon. Mm. Lake trout's good, but salmon's even better. So tasty. Fresh fish. Caught this morning, this afternoon. Got the potatoes. Sour cream and cheese on them. Yummy. And a little bit of red wine. Wonderful. Well, there you have it. It's pretty simple, pretty easy to make. Um, leave a comment down below. Any of you fish quabbin reservoir, or maybe you have a different recipe for the salmon and the lake trout. Let me know what you think. If you're looking forward to seeing more cooking and fishing videos, please subscribe. I'll see you next time. Enjoy the outdoors, get out there, have fun, and I'll see you on the next adventure. Thanks for watching.